Fuck no. Fuck no. <sighs> Alright, welcome to my let's play of Assassin's Creed Unity. I wanted to do this for so long now, but I got several troubles with with recording this game. But now I think it's stable enough, it's smooth enough, and I hope we can now enjoy a new epic adventure on a so-called next-gen game. <clears throat> I got seriously some issues to record this because it didn't want to record in the first place. But now it seems everything is fine and we can enjoy this hopefully together. Ah, well, oh, all right, let's keep going. The past is not lost. The past lives inside us. Encoded in the double helix are the experiences of our ancestors. After three decades of research, our engineers have forged the cutting edge of biotechnological interfaces. We have unlocked the lives of our forebears. We have opened a window into the past. This is Total Immersion Entertainment. With the press of a button, you will experience the most pivotal moments in history. All from the comfort of home. Welcome to Helix. Where the past is your playground. I really love such epic music and intros like that. It always gets me teary eyes. I don't know why, but yeah, I don't want to uh, hold this any longer. So we're just going to start. Last of the heroic Knights Templar, Jacques de Molay was a man of principle, a towering intellect, betrayed by those he trusted. In this episode of Fallen Heroes, experience Jacques de Molay's final tragic hours through the eyes of one of his closest friends and advisors. Wow, this sounds motivating. Ah, the loading screen, it always takes minutes to finally load, and I don't know why. <sighs> Who goes there? A friend of the temple. Flaurak. The Council's message was absolute. You're not welcome here. I must speak with the Grand Master. He's in session. They all are. Another day, perhaps. King Philip disagrees. Damn you, man. Why you're not rotting in a cell at this moment, I cannot fathom. We are betrayed! Draw your swords, men! Defend the temple! Not you, brother. I have a different task for you. Come with me. King Philip's moving faster than we expected. Mm -hmm. Another hand is at work here. 
the Pope? The Assassins. Assassins? I thought the Mongol Khans broke their power decades ago. The Assassins are far older than Masayev, my friend. Their anarchic delusions are virulent as the plague, and less easily eradicated. We will not prevail this night, but if you make haste, we may yet save our order. What must I do? Go to the tower. Take the sword and the book. Hide them. They must not fall into the assassin's hands. Grandmaster, I Go! will. Right, I guess it's time to run. Yeah, let's kill the assassin. Oh, it's so dark, I can't see. Oh, well. Hold the bridge! Hold! Dad! I have to take a different way. How convenient! Yeah, I know the beginning already, so... The first few episodes where we go really fast, because I already know the way and stuff like that. But... I didn't finish the game yet once. So it, even the ending will be a surprise for me because I didn't spoil on myself. So Whoa! Whoa, this was new! I didn't know he could jump this high. Why is this so tiny? So good. Maybe I should line up this a little bit. The tower. They've breached the, the tower. They've taken them. Right. Kill the assassin. Oh! <laughs> I'm always scared because of those situations. We think, oh, now I'm going to die, but nope. He can jump this far. It's really sad that we are not... Uh, what? I avoided a smoke bomb. Right! Let's... Oh! Oh! I was supposed to... Controller too low on the ground.
Pope Clement, hear me? Before this year is out, you will answer for your crimes before God Almighty! And you, King Philip, no punishment is too heinous for the great evil you have inflicted upon the temple! I curse you! Curse you to the 13th generation of your blood! You shall be cursed! Consumed in flames of hunger and wrath, thus came the age of true wisdom to a blistering close. The Knights Templar, once the proud shepherds of order, peace, and illumination, were no more. How sad. Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. Oh. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop, not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys have their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frighten you, it should. But we're here to stop them, and I need your help. Deacon, preload gene sequence, uh, AD16, B13, I87. Yep, spooling it up. Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. For now, we'd like you to experience a small sample. This should help you understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. We'll be waiting. All right, how nice of you. <clears throat> well, I should enable VSync because I got a little bit of tearing, but that's only because I have kind of an old monitor. This looks so great. Oh no. Can't I go with you, father? Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. That's forever. Not as long as all that. And when I get back, we'll see the fireworks. And Arno, no exploring, hmm? Yes, father. God, it seems I have no longer these annoying frame droppings. You'd rather sit with that old prune? Come on. In well, <laughs> uh, in cutscenes. Yeah, that was I wanted to say. Too slow. Normally they frame drop like what? I th <laughs> this is a bug right there again. My pig. Une espèce de jeu. Garde, attrapez-les. You're gonna get such a thrashing. Quickly, quickly. <laughs> allez. Allez, allez. I'm right back at you. Bet you can't steal one. Of course I can. How do I do this? Oh, there. Hello. Put that back! No. Damn it! What the hell's going on? Stealth action! I failed this so much the first times. 
as I try to record this. And he's just laughing. So let's hope he can't find us anymore. And we're good. Hurry, through here. Did you see their faces when we stole those apples? <laughs> I'm Arno. Elise. I'm here with my father. So am I. He has important business with the king. What should we do now? Shh. Listen. Don't worry. They'll never think to look for us in here. It was my fault. I'm the one who took the apple. Let's see where they're going. Yeah, follow the girl. I'm always following the girls. Monsieur Franklin, I sincerely hope this unfortunate affair does not darken your opinion of our nation. Monsieur, if we judged nations by the character of their criminals, we should all be called barbarians. Oh, I know what's gonna happen. Elise. Father? Come here, girl, now. Father? It's quite a time jump. Can't win fairly at cards, so you stoop to thieving, you bastard! Calm down, Victor. I've only come for my watch. It's my watch. I want it fairly. Well, in a just world, Victor, I would agree with you, but this is not a just world. This is France. You're a dead man! Oh, step lightly there. You'll hurt yourself. Ah! Just had a nice chat with your brother. You go. Fetch the marshals. Hold on a minute. Diable. I've got it, Victor. Oh, I need to get him. Don't get tackled. Sorry. Wait. It's over. Pass under. I love this mechanic. Pardon, madam. Gentlemen, please, we can come to an understanding. Please, excuse him, he's not housebroken. Man! Can't get him! It's too fast! Bam! Headed blacksmith like you probably can't even read a watch. Come over here and say that. Uh, no. Get back here. Who's on there? vous de lui. Keeping up. Shall I call a break? So slow. Whoa! I get shot for stealing a watch. This is insane. Uh, 
Ah, but I did it. I legitly did it. Good. Mission accomplished. Maybe a chest? No? Oh, I... Whoa! What? I, I've never done that kind of jump before. This is awesome. All right, so let's go in here. Woo. Oh, this game is so smooth. It's so smooth now. Well, at least it feels smooth for me. I hope for you as well. Oh, come on here. I also like them in the B and A mechanic. A to go up, B to go down. And where in God's name have you been? Ha! Huh. Got you now, you little shit! Just a little misunderstanding. Nothing to... Your master's arboring a common criminal. In broad daylight, he broke into my home and stole my watch. Did he indeed? Well, I'm sure the Marshalsea would be more than willing to sort this out. Sort what out, Olivier? Um... A most serious accusation against your ward, sir. He robbed me. <laughs> of what, precisely? Wait for me in my library. Don't give me that look. Victor cheats when he plays Pharaoh. Everyone knows it. Arno? Who are you talking to? No one, monsieur. You'll be happy to learn I persuaded Olivier to leave off calling the Marshalsea. Again. Je vous remercie, monsieur. What is this? The sixth time? The seventh? Perhaps a new hobby might be better for your health. Well, I find playing cards affords many opportunities for fresh air and exercise. <laughs> we'll talk about this later. I have business in town and must collect Elise before I can attend to it. Elise is here? Only for the night. She returns to Paris first thing tomorrow. She'll need an escort. Won't she with you so preoccupied? One of you running amok is quite enough. Remain here and see if Olivier has any chores for you. I'm sure he does. What was that? Give my regards to Elise. All right, never mind. There are still those frame droppings and cutscenes. I don't know what causes them or how I could prevent them, but I tried everything and there's just... No workaround for me, at least. But I hope you will bear with me anyway. And yeah, see you in the next episode.